Hi, I'm Dr. Darren at HolisticDoctor.com and I'm coming to you from the Nutritional Healing Center of Ann Arbor. And this is an episode of Healthcare the Way Mother Nature Intended. And the topic today is whole food vitamins versus synthetic vitamins. So I have some samples here and this is a synthetic multivitamin and uh, the tablet looks like this. It's got yellow number five, yellow number six, and blue number two in it as artificial colors. There are, you are not deficient in artificial colors. So if, you're, if you have a multivitamin at your house with artificial colors in it, throw it away, it's junk. The first ingredient in, in here is calcium carbonate, which is a rock. It's sold as a nutritional supplement for calcium, but actually calcium carbonate is not what our bodies want. So therefore, this is very heavy. Also, it has 21 nutrients, and that's it. And these are actually aren't really even foods, these are more chemicals. And our body doesn't recognize these nutrients as being healthy or nutritional, but instead treats them as chemicals as they are. This multivitamin is the one that we recommend. It is um, filled with whole food nutrition. And uh, let me just compare the two. Here's the synthetic one. This is a 12-day supply in this little jar. It's 1.7 ounces. This is the other one. Oops. This is a 12-day supply. And this is 1.4 ounces. And the difference is, this one is plants. And the plant's roots go down into the soil, soak up the minerals, and then you harvest the plants, as opposed to mining rocks and putting rocks into a tablet. So you want to eat the plants, not the rocks. Now the whole food multivitamin over here has carrot in it. So carrot has over 200 known nutrients, and there's a list of them. And it may have thousands of nutrients that we don't know of. So if you add the carrot with all these other foods, these foods, and you take the water and the fiber out, then you're left with thousands of nutrients, known and unknown. So that's what we're talking about when we talk about whole food nutrition. It's the food, and you subtract out the water and the fiber, and you're left with thousands of nutrients, known and unknown. Okay, let's move over to this. These are B vitamins. This is a synthetic B vitamin supplement, or a B complex. And when I open it, first of all, I smell it. It smells like a chemical factory. So smell your B-complex. If it's disgusting, it smells like chemicals, it's junk. And it's fluorescent. Some of them are more yellow, others are more orange, and it'll make your urine fluorescent. That is not natural. That is not food. There is, there is no food in Mother Nature that makes your urine fluorescent. Okay, so now it's, a lot of B vitamins are sold for stress. And uh, we, I see a lot of patients that come in, they're all stressed out. They're already on a B-complex but they still feel stressed out. What we do is we put them on a whole food B vitamin like this, and then their stresses start to go away. They feel better. I mean, they still have their life problems, but they feel better about it. They're better able to cope. Their energy goes up. Now, the first ingredient in this one is bovine liver. The second ingredient is nutritional yeast. So Mother Nature put lots of B vitamins in those two foods, liver and yeast, both nutritional yeast. So this company takes those two nutrients and, and dozens more of uh, foods, dries them out, takes out the fiber, and you're left with thousands of nutrients, but specifically with the B vitamins with this, with this uh, particular supplement. So I hope that helps. You can go to your cupboard and look at your uh, supplements and see what's good and what's bad. And uh, that's your um, discussion on synthetic vitamins versus whole food vitamins so that you can take care of your health the way Mother Nature intended.